Hi, welcome to Land Space Architecture. In this video, we'll guide you through how to render stunning landscape plan in Photoshop. Method 1, using ready-to-use PSD trees. So, I've already loaded the basic blueprint into Photoshop, and now I'm going to utilize the color palette to change the background color of the grass layer. To pick a color, I'll be using the eyedropper tool, shortcut, I, and then I'll simply press Alt plus Delete to fill the selected color. Let's repeat the steps we just went through and apply the same process to replace the colors of various areas. Now, let's begin adding trees to the plan. In the first method, I'll simply duplicate the pre-designed trees from our package onto the master plan and adjust their sizes accordingly. Hold ATL and drag the tree to duplicate the tree, and repeat. To organize the trees, press Ctrl plus G to group them together. Then, adjust the opacity of the group to 60% for a desired effect. Then I'm going to duplicate some seasonal trees from pre-designed trees. Avoid using an excessive number of colors for the group of trees on the master plan, as it can be distracting. However, you can add a touch of warm colored trees on the sides of the canvas to introduce some variation to the tree groups. This subtle addition will bring visual interest without overpowering the overall composition. Next, I'd like to make some color adjustments to the trees by utilizing the colors from the template. To pick a color, I'll be using the eyedropper tool, shortcut, I, and then I'll simply press Alt plus Delete to fill the selected color. To access the layer style options for the tree group, simply double click on it. Once inside the layer style panel, enable the drop shadow effect. Now, we come to the most crucial part, adding layer effects using texture brushes. This step will significantly enhance the overall appearance. Included in the tree package are 70 trees with commonly known names, along with 15 textures specifically designed for plan rendering, and 36 PSD trees. Let's get started and apply some texture effects above the background grass layer. By applying textures to the grass layer, you can instantly enhance the visual appearance of your master plan. With textures, your landscape plan will come alive with depth and realism. Clients will be amazed as they step into a world filled with lush greenery and dynamic landscapes. Don't settle for mediocrity. Elevate your designs and make a lasting impression by adding textures to the grass layer. It's time to unleash the full potential of your landscape plan rendering. For consistency in the overall rendering, I recommend using colors from the color swatches to apply textures. This will ensure a harmonious look throughout the design. Additionally, consider applying concrete field textures to the orange trail, as they can provide a visually appealing and realistic effect. The combination of these elements will enhance the overall aesthetic of the landscape plan. Once the textures have been applied, you have the option to create an adjustment layer to modify the hue and saturation of the plan, allowing you to fine-tune the color tone. With this adjustment, you can achieve the desired atmosphere and mood for your landscape design. And just like that, we've completed method 1 of the plan. Method 2, using tree brushes. In this method, we'll be drawing two layers of trees. To begin, I'll utilize the default circle brush with a hardness set to 100% in order to create the first layer of trees. Set the layer opacity to 60 to 80%. Following that, I'll create a new layer and proceed to draw the outlines of the trees using our brush set. 
To enable a stroke effect with a white color, simply double-click on the first tree layer and activate the stroke option. Included within the tree brush pack are 70 trees labeled with common names, providing you with a wide range of options for your plan rendering. Additionally, the pack also offers 15 textures designed specifically to enhance the visual appearance of your designs. Lastly, remember to apply textures to the grass layers to add that final touch of detail. Once this step is complete, your landscape plan will be fully finished and ready to impress.